you know, you are taking your computer to some type of service center and they will have access to all your files, all your photos and, and everything that you have on there. Welcome to another Tech Tips. This Tech Tips is called My Computer's Broke. Should I fix it? I can't tell you how many times someone tells me that they're having computer problems and they need to get it fixed. And they want to call for IT help to fix their computer. We, I think we've, we've come to a certain time in the, in the tech world, if you don't know already, if something breaks, it's almost less expensive to replace it. So with that being said, most of these calls that I get, I, I just have to ask the questions, you know, what year did you purchase your computer? Was it a year old, two years, three years? You know, that's gonna matter at this point because it might be time to just replace it. If it's been three years, I would say we might wanna just think about replacing it. Um, how much is a computer gonna cost you? Three, four, five, you know, $600, I don't know. How much will tech service cost you on site? I mean, I don't know, we're in 2022, what are they charging for on-site service? Is it about, you know, for a home on call, if you call the Geek Squad, um, it's gonna cost you maybe, what, $200? You know, it, and how much is your computer worth? If, it, if the price goes above 300 for your repairs and you can get a brand new computer for $500, it might be worth just picking up something new. It should be under warranty. The cost of things seem to be going up so much that, you know, why pay for, for service when the goods, um, the actual computers, those don't seem to be uh, rising along with the service charges, if that makes sense. So um, it might be a whole nother topic, but I'm just trying to give you a good perspective of, you know, what to expect when it comes to, to cost and repair. Okay, so Geek Squad has an interesting service. I don't know all the details, but don't quote me for it. In 2021, I think they had a service where for, I don't know, maybe about, you know, a buck 29, $129, you can go down and you can um, sign up for, I don't know, I think it was like a year worth of service or something crazy like that, 200 bucks. And you would be able to take your computer to any authorized Best Buy um, and get service on your computer for no additional cost, unless you had viruses, unless, you know, they kind of had a list of things that were out there. So to the most part, if you just have one off and you have a computer, you just want to get something kind of fixed and you do want the repair option, there are some services out there, very inexpensive, okay? But the service is less personalized and you have to really think about, you know, you are taking your computer to some type of service center and they will have access to all your files, all your photos and, and everything that you have on there. And if you really need IT service, it's probably not a good idea to call IT service as far as expense wise to call IT service just to fix, you know, like a slow computer. It's better to have an IT company manage your computers than that way they can work out the details if you do have a slow computer. They could probably figure out really quick what's going on with it. But for a one-time call, I need to fix this you know, old computer that I have here, you probably are better off going with either your local computer uh, repair service like similar to the Geek Squad or just replacing it if it's over three years old. Uh, if you have any questions, as always, reach out to us, give us a call, and we'll see how we can help you with your, your computer problems. Thanks.
in med tech. If you got a problem, I know.